So hey you guys, um, I haven't really been doing that much on here lately because I've been working on a painting um, this past October. I've been watching a lot of Beetlejuice, it's kind of like a Halloween staple for me. And I've been watching him more often, or it more often than usual, because I decided to be Lydia this last Halloween. So I was getting really into it, watching a lot, study her, you know, making sure I get her just right. And I had the idea to do a Beetlejuice themed painting, mainly for myself, because, you know, I thought it'd be fun. And since it was for myself, nothing really came of it. It wasn't really a big push for me until I saw a Tim Burton themed bar slash grill, I guess you could call it because it's a restaurant too, in New York called Beetle House, um, thanking people for donating art to them. And I thought, this is perfect. If I'm going to do a Beetlejuice painting, it should go there. I want to donate to them. So I've been working on it. And I thought it'd be kind of cool to do a little bit with you guys here, you know, kind of like Bob Ross, but a little less happy because I don't really do, I mean, when I do accidents, they're not really happy accidents, they're more frustrated yelling, I hate this kind of thing. Hopefully I won't do any, um, but this is the painting so far, for those of you guys who want to see it and know the movie. So you kind of tell this is going to be the Maitlands, I actually have the picture saved on my laptop right here that I've been working off of just to get the details right, even though honestly I've seen the movie so many times I probably don't need the picture, but we'll just, you know, kind of ignore that fact. But anyway, so here's a little bit of it. I'll try to stay out of your guys' way. You can see how I'm doing it. I'm just going to go over. I made this mark earlier. His shirt's actually taking a lot longer than I anticipated. So it'll be a while, but I didn't even think about her dress yet. With all the little details, it's going to be tough. But I've been working on this for, let's see, mm, two weeks now. So it's going to be a while before it's done, but it's been pretty fun so far. Okay, let's see, I'll do that one there, and then this one is here. And I'll be going over that. A little bit so I could fit in his pocket right here. I haven't really figured out the trick for that yet, you know, trying, I mean, I guess I could have just avoided this completely, you know, just make a little pocket, just try and get the line straight, but since I'm not very good at straight lines and, you know, trying to break it up, I just figure I put a little white in there like here. So, that's a little bit of it. I just kind of prove that it's mine, that I'm not just screwing up someone else's painting or stealing painting. I swear this is mine. So it kind of sounds like something I do, but this is pretty fun. So um, I'm going to be making prints of this. I don't know how many of you guys are interested, if you're interested at all. But after I, or before I give it to them, I'll be making prints to sell on my Etsy page. So let me know if you're interested at all. It's not, it's not done yet. I still have something here, here, and something I want to put above the house. I won't tell you what it is, but if you're interested in seeing the finished product, I'll make another video of it. And if you're interested in it at all, let me know, and I'll let you know when it's on Etsy and available. Okay? Alright, see you guys later.